All right, we're going to call the uh, Cornell and Rogers case. Uh, it's about uh, 10.45. Do we have Anton Cornell connected? Do we have the Anton Cornell connected? Rogers connected. Here. All right, thank you very much for your patience. Um, the, uh, do we have only one person connected? Yes, sir. Okay, so we had a hearing uh, in this case. Uh, and by the way, thank you for uh, your patience. I know you've been waiting uh, to be connected. Uh, June 9, 2021, we issued temporary orders. We made a referral to mediation. Uh, we issued a visitation order, and uh, today was the time set. Uh, are we sure that this is a 10 o'clock return, or is this 11 o'clock return? It's the same 10 o'clock. If you look at the journal entry from June 9th, it says return hearing August 4th, 11 a.m. That's tomorrow's, yeah. Yeah, okay, so we're going to vacate that hearing. Um, I, I need both of you here. We have a partial agreement that shows that you participated in mediation, and but uh, right. you're not here. It didn't resolve everything, but it did resolve some important holidays. It resolved legal custody, school breaks. Um, have you talked to Mr. Uh, Cornell about the case? Uh, we have not discussed the case at all. Um, I have the TPO on him, and we had the um, domestic violence case this morning at 8 o'clock, and he was appeared there, so I don't know his reasoning for not being here today. I didn't see a related case. Uh, did you just file the application today or yesterday? So I've had a TP I mean, I've had a domestic violence case on him since 2000. I filed that in my initial paperwork. However, um, I had to file the TPO on July 8th and um, was granted. And I have an extended court date uh, for August 26th, if I'm not mistaken, to get that granted, uh, to get it extended, because he also broke the TPO. Right, but I, I, I'm looking at the, is this in a Nevada case? It is in a Nevada case, yes. Okay, do you have the case number? Because I'm looking at your related cases, and I see a bunch of TPOs, uh -huh. most of them are from 16, 17, and 18. So yeah, the it's case? the 18, 2018. Um, it, that, it, that case is still open. How is it still open? The, How is it still open? Um, because he hasn't did everything that he's required to do to close it. All right, again, maybe we're not communicating well. A protective order case is a T case. They can't be extended for longer than a year or two. And that case right. was uh, extended in February 2018. So by, it, it expired in July 2018. So it must be a different case type than a protective order case. So tell me what, okay. do you have a case number? I have the case number for the domestic violence and the TPO. How about the case number for the case you said you were in court on today? Um, 18F. Zero one uh, zero. That's not, that's not a protective order case. That's a uh, well, that's justice a, court case. And that's the best. What court? T two one. Okay, so we were in court today for the domestic what, what, violence case. Court, what court were you in? Um, criminal or civil court. Right, that's not a protective order case. That's a that's a criminal uh, domestic violence right. case. Okay, so I don't right. have, I don't have access to those uh, that paperwork, okay. but. Um, this is what I'm going to do because he's not here. I was going to resolve matters today and ask whether or not the, the parenting agreement should be filed, uh, but he's not on the connection. We're set for tomorrow, and it's possible that uh, he's confused between today and tomorrow. So the matter is going to be set over as scheduled for case management and mediation return tomorrow at 11. Just reconnect at 11. If he's not connected then, after not appearing today, and if he doesn't connect tomorrow, then I'll make orders and look to close this case. If he does connect tomorrow, then I'll be able to do what I plan on doing today, which is to get information from you to decide whether or not we set a trial or whether we enter the parenting agreement, okay? All right, I have that TPO order um, number right, as well. You, 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 
I, I'm all ears. I would love to see the orders that you have. It's probably not a TPO order. It's probably an order related to a criminal case. I'm interested in seeing it. A TPO order is a civil <laughs> order under a T case. And you should know that because you I have, have about five of them from 2017 and 18. So, yeah, you're absolutely right. I, I know about it. Um, I was confused because you said about the court we went to this morning, so that was the criminal court. The TPO case is T21-2154-1700. Okay, let me write that down. T21-215-517 or 417? Uh, 21-215472. Seven two. All right, yeah. and, and when did you make that application? That one was on 7 8, 2021. Wow, did you make it under a different name? No, you know what? So it is his name is spelled incorrectly on his last name. I think it's C A R R E L. Well, I'm just saying that but we have a name based system and it's supposed to pull up related cases. And so I want to know all current cases involving you guys so that I can do a better job as far as understanding what you're dealing with. I see okay. I see the case. I'm going to print out the case summary. Um, it okay. is a, uh, I see that there was, um, oh my goodness, yeah, it, that there was a request to extend that was denied last week um, on the 26th. Did you... Uh, did you ask for show cause alleging a violation of the protective order? I did, yeah, and that was denied, and it was um, given a court date, the regular court date of August 26th, if I'm not mistaken, or 23rd. Uh, so I, did, I, I wasn't granted the shortening time. Okay, so it hasn't been heard yet then? It has not, no. All right, so that protective order is uh, through August 3rd, 2021. That's today. I mean, uh, yeah, that's today, right? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, but they said it actually extends until the actual TPO court date. Well, where is the court date? Um, let me see. I was given right, a... Okay. August 23rd. Okay, we'll talk about this tomorrow. I'll, I appreciate the information. I uh, have printed out the case summary for that case, so I've had a chance to look at it. Uh, you are correct that there was a protective order. I mean, I, what I'm concerned about is that the protective order expires today. So they'll probably do a new order for today to take us to August 23rd, okay? Uh, obviously, we want to make okay. sure that, that nobody violates any protective orders. Um, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll talk about this case again tomorrow, okay? All right. All right, hang in there. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Okay, we're off the record. You can go ahead and hit the red button at the top of your screen to disconnect. Thank you.